I've bought a box full of cool stuff and this box is so big, even Belle could fit in it. contacted by somebody I know who was selling off some of their collection and this is it and this is a big box full of stuff and hopefully it's cool stuff I have seen the majority of what is in here and it cost me 190 pound that was including shipping so let's get this open and see what we got Here we go. Now, most of this stuff is going to go straight to my whatnot auctions, but one or two things might end up on eBay. Now, they did say they were going to put a few extras in for me, and this looks like it is one of the extras. It is a vin vintage Taz play by play. Nice little extra to be thrown in. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Assuming you're watching. Needs a little repair on the side there, but that's okay. And that's another extra is this, I think it's, is it Build-A-Bear? Yeah, it's a Build-A-Bear. No sound box. But it's still a nice little Build-A-Bear uh, Pikachu. Uh, that's all right. That's, a, that's an added bonus. I think they were using it as a void fill just to protect the rest of the stuff in here. So we've got all kinds of things. Let's get right into it. Okay, we've got a Pokemon Go field guide and a poster here as well. I'll be very delicate with this one. Official Nintendo poster. Ooh, it is pretty delicate. Let's see what we got, Pokemon. Very delicate indeed. I'll have to look up that and see what we're looking at with that. Condition, I think this is an extra anyway, you know. Condition is very, very delicate. We need to be careful. But it was an extra, so that wasn't part of it. Which is all good. We love extras. We love a good bungle. Yu-Gi-Oh! Official third season. Thank you very much for that one. DVD, all good. That's cool. Right, now I think that is it. Oh, hang on a minute, what's this? Yu-Gi-Oh! trading card holder thing. Little folder. That was an extra thing, that was an extra. I don't recall that being in, in the bundle that I had a look at on a video. Right. Now, everything else in here, 190 quid, some lovely little extras there. Let's get everything out and we'll do a couple of things at a time if we can, because there is quite a lot. We've got a DC, is it Harley Quinn? Yep, yeah, Harley Quinn and a Harry Potter Lego set. Hopefully you can see those okay. What else have we got? We've got a Harry Potter wand, you can't beat a wand. Bit of damage on the back there. I'm not convinced it's a genuine wand. I think it's a replica. Just looking at the box and everything, so I'm guessing that that is a replica uh, wand. Let's see what else. There's another Harry Potter one. This one it looks more genuine. This is better. Let's see what we've got in here. Get it open. Bloody hell. What was rattling? Oh. There is like a lenticular type bookmarky thing. And then there's a wand in there as well. Harry Potter wand. That one, uh, that one's definitely legit. Um, oh. Uh, that's a pretty nice bobble head. You can see there. Iron Man. Nice. I like that. Marvel Heroes 2006. That's 
pretty cool. Very nice figure that. Got a Harry Potter something here, Book of Spells. What is it? Oh, interesting. I've not seen one of those. I'll have to put some batteries in it, see what it does, but it's a calculator and something else. Interesting that. By Tiger. Sure that I'll have some value. Uh, oh, I don't know. I can't get that. Right, we've got a load of pops. A load of pops. So let's get a few out at a time. Uh, we've got some Dragon Ball Z here. Remember, this was just one big bundle price. Uh, £190 for everything that you are seeing in the pictures here in the video. I think, from what I can gather, I've got a good deal, I reckon. But you never know until you actually um, sort of have things in your hand and you can see the quality, you make sure there's no damage, etc. Because the thing with pop figures, it's all about the condition, isn't it, really? If your box is a bit knackered, the value is just, like, is shot to pieces. So, box condition is really important. More Dragon Ball Z. Some Avengers. A little bit of fading on the front of that one. I have seen a little bit of damage on some of the boxes, but I could see that when I uh, purchased, and that's how we came to a price as well. Loads of pop figures. To be fair, more than I remember. Uh, a damaged box on that one. The Dragon Ball Z, Game of Thrones. If you ever watch any of my videos and you see something you fancy for yourself, do drop me a message. You can find me on the Tinternet, um, Instagram, Facebook, Carboot Chris. This one's got some damage, this sort of potion bottle thing. I'll have to have a look at that. Um, that's obviously come off something, I think. I'll have a look. A couple of loose pop figures here. What these ones are. Harry Potter with the snitch and the Quidditch thing, broomstick, broom flying thing. Uh, I'm not sure what she's out of. Won't take me long to find, that's a, an easy find. Um, I still don't know what that stand is from. Oh, we've got an oversized pop, a big pop. It is Hagrid number seven, that's nice, I like that one. It's a nice one, talking about the big ones. That's what she said. Oh, I can't get these out. Here we go. Uh, a couple more, quite a few Dragon Ball Zs. Some damage on these ones. As I said, I am aware that some of them were damaged. This is not a surprise. Oh, that one's in a box, but it's got no inside packaging. Shang-Chi and um, Venom. As I say, that venom is missing the inside. Avatar there, 999. Uh, another oversized Game of Thrones this time. Viserion, one of the dragons. Can't say really that I've ever sat and watched Game of Thrones, but Belle loves it. She's watched the whole thing. I can't, I can't get into it. Getting a bit stuck at the bottom here now. Very well packaged, thank you. Oh. Couple more Dragon Ball Zs here. Perfect Cell and Future Mai. Stacks and stacks of pops. What 
we got here? We've got Game of Thrones and Falcon Winter Soldier. Game of Thrones the 01. Maybe I can get something else out here now, yeah. Freed up a bit of space. I've got a Golden Snitch Heli Ball. Looks like a remote control thing. Hand control. Oh, interesting. Like a hand control ball-y thing. What have we got here? Harley Quinn. Hardback graphic novel what is this another snitch just like in a i don't even think it lights up or anything it's just on like a, a figure ornamental thing needs a little clean up uh, that's a couple more pop figures more Dragon Ball Z, that one's got damage on the back. Got another Venom here, is that the same Venom as before? Possibly the same Venom. Looks a little... No, not the same Venom. Uh, and another Dragon Ball Z. To the bottom of the box. Dragon Ball Z and Thor Ragnarok. Uh, let's take these out. What are these? I wasn't aware these were coming, so these are added extras. We've got some Pokemon like uh, sort of laminated posters. This one, whoops, daisy. Another Pokemon one. I don't know if these have got value. I'll have to look them up. Pokemon, gotta catch them all. And the Pokemon chart sort of thing, identifying different creatures or whatever. What's this one? It's kind of a chart. Maybe you tick, tick them off as you get them or find them or whatever. I don't know. I have, oh, I have caught. This poster chart belongs to. Oh, okay. So you catch them. Is it from the game? Pokey, catch them, whatever. I don't know. Oh, wait a minute. Still more pops to come. Let's get a few out here for you at once, because my back can't take it. Okay, let's have a look at these. A couple of Game of Thrones here. Oopsie daisy, there we go. Lots of pops. Avatar and Dragon Ball Z. And another Game of Thrones. Dragon is a bigger one, a big pop. A little bit of damage on the top, but nothing major. I've got to get up again. Ooh. Oh, God. I think this is the biggest box I've had delivered. Daisy, another dragon from Dragon, from not Dragon Ball Z, um, Game of Thrones. Oversized. Um, another Venom, uh, again without the inside um, packaging. I've got a load of loose figures here as well at the bottom. Let's grab those two. Oh. 
All right, what we got here? Dragon Ball. Bulma. Lots of figures to work through. So a lot of these are going to end up on my whatnot auction shows, but um, some might end up also on eBay. We'll see. I might split them up because there is quite a lot here. Uh, right, let's just turn this around because we've got a load of loose figures now. Load of loose stuff. I think this goes with this. Harley Quinn thing. Like that. What else we got? Um, anime. I'm not sure what the anime is. It's an anime figure. Interesting looking figure. Where's that stand? Because that probably belongs to one of these. This stand, I need to look out what that is for. Another, oh, is that Dragon Ball? Not Dragon Ball. It's a larger figurine, that's nice. I like that one. Another is this Dragon Ball as well? I think so. Oh, Dragon Ball stuff. Right, nice big figures. Some loose bits and pieces. figurine here. Can you see that okay? Um, a Harry Potter loose pop. Uh, another Harry Potter. What's this? What's this? I don't know what that is. Oh, hang on a minute. I see it at the bottom. It's like a banner. Sword in the darkness. Yeah, I need to look that up because I haven't got a clue what that is. I shall have fun researching. There's another one here. It looks to me like it's Game of Thrones kind of style. I think it's Game of Thrones. You might tell me I'm wrong, but I feel like it's Game of Thrones. Another one there, another one of those things. What's this? A Harry Potter scarf, maybe? Yeah, Wizarding World, Harry Potter, new with tags. Got a Gryffindor on it. What's this? Another kind of anime figurine here. Right, I might, oh, he's missing his head. Uh, that's a Harry Potter, loose figure, pop figure. Yeah, he's missing his head. I found it. Right, calm down, don't lose your head. Here we go. It's Dragon Ball Z, I think. And I think this comes with this because it's got a little a little stand there. So yes, that is from that. There we go. Dragon Ball Z. And there's a couple more bits in here. 
Um, some more Harry Potter. Belle's going to love looking through these. Loose Pop. Uh, we've got a Dobby with his little sock. Loose one. And uh, the owl. Which I can't remember his name. Is it Hedwig or something like that? And the last things to come out of the box is this Dragon Ball Z thing. I need to figure out. These just look like they're from, I don't know. I don't know if that needs to go with that or if not, it's just at the bottom of the box. So I need to figure out where those have come from. And that is everything. I paid £190 for everything that you see. There was a few extras thrown in, so I thank you very much for that. Um, I'm happy with that. I think there's money in that and it will be good for my whatnot store to bulk it out, keep the shows going, keep the auctions going. Um, there's information below if you want to sign up to whatnot. You get some free money as, as I do as well if you sign up using my link. But free money, you can't argue with that, can you? Anywhere you go, free money is good. Um, that's it. I've bought this huge box of collectibles. Oh, Cookie, no, you've got to stay over there. <laughs> Cooks, come on. Go, go. <laughs> Cookie's bed. Go on. This box is so big, even Belle could fit in it. As always, thank you for watching. Thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to subscribe. And um, I'm gonna put a couple of videos up um, by the side of me that might interest you. Other unboxings or something similar. Um, feel free to go and binge. See you later. Bye.